The Southern Lakes Conference features some of the best wrestling in the state, and tonight we have a matchup of the two best teams. Burlington comes in number seven in the state. They ride a 25 dual match winning streak in conference. Meanwhile, Elkhorn comes in at number 12 in Wisconsin, and they are tied for first in the conference. The Elks had this one circled from day one, and it showed. In the opening match, Connor Leahy with a takedown of Ben Travis in overtime to gain a hard-fought 4-2 win. That was followed up by Bryce Fitzgerald, who pinned Robbie Ellsbury late in the third period to give Elkhorn a quick 9-0 team lead. Our coaches pump us up a lot during their speeches. It just gets us all going. It's good to start off with a win. It gets the team going most of the meet, so it's good. At 126, Ryan Nelson kept that momentum going. He scores the pinfall on Josiah Kusick as the Elk lead goes to 15. But the Demons mount a rally led by Ben Hornicle. He pins Riley Remington shoulders to the mat to move to 26 and one as the Elk advantage is cut to a mere six points. Then the most exciting match of the night. The Elks John Olson is up too late when Demon Wes Gavin scores a takedown to tie it up but Olsen recovers with a beautiful reversal to pull out a huge 9-7 victory. But just knowing you tied it up at the end, just, I just knew I had to stay calm and just do what I know, and just getting that reversal really, uh, really helped me get that victory. Another tight match followed as Walker Damask and Isaiah Brenner were tied with eight seconds to go, but Damask with an escape at the horn to add to the Elkhorn total. The match that wrapped it up for the Elks was at 195, as Dylan Linhart stayed in control in sudden death, riding out Chris Marks to give Elkhorn an insurmountable lead. The score was tied at 30 after all the matches, but with an 8-6 win advantage on the night, Elkhorn gets the dual victory as Burlington suffers their first conference loss since 2009. When we talked about wrestling Burlington tonight, it wasn't about uh, beating Burlington, it was about wrestling better than we did last time. I really, really believe in that, and I think our kids did that tonight. It's unbelievable. It just shows us that we're uh, here to stay and we're not to, we're not to be messed with. That's it. <laughs>